It was a dark night, and special detective Adolf, Adolf Hitler, was drinking his peppermint schnapps and waiting for a customer. It had been weeks since he'd have a customer, and he'd let his dreadlocks grow long. And then there she was, Josephine Stalin, formerly Joseph Stalin. He had a problem. And she, I mean, she had a, had a problem. I have a problem. I will help you. It's my job as Adolf Hitler. You see, Josephine's old boyfriend was a dermatologist. He had told her that she had cancer. What he didn't know that it was that it, that mole on her face, it was a beauty spot she drew on her face with permanent marker. Fifty years ago, she couldn't get it off. So she flew into a rage. Stabbed him eight times in the large toe. He ran out bleeding. <laughs> and she didn't know what happened to him. Of course, she wouldn't tell Hitler this. You see, she wanted Hitler. <laughs> they both decided it would be best to set out on foot to look for the dermatologist. So they did. First they had to primp, of course, make sure they looked beautiful in their manly, womanly way. And then they left. Bo both of them left. Of course, Hitler went first, and Stalin watched him all the way. He enjoyed it. Of course, they didn't really find much. Didn't really find anything at all besides the living room. They actually stayed in the house the whole time. They're not very smart. So they went back to the office, because they didn't find anything at all. They realized they need to split up. Because they forgot that they weren't mutes and tried to, like, sign language each other. Oh, yeah. And then realized they weren't mutes. I go that way. You're going to go that way. I'll go that way. Exactly what I said. All right. This is the part of the ways. What did you find? As it turned out, Hitler had found where the dermatologist was hiding. It's, 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 he's in the dishwasher. He was actually hiding in her closet. Uh, he's in the dishwasher. Her lingerie closet. I believe I said in the dishwasher. Closet in her very own house, across from her very own bedroom. I believe in the dishwasher, the place in which you wash the dishes. The closet that contains All right, lingerie. he's in the closet. Okay. She sang and she flushed. So they walked up to the closet. They had a look. Oh, wait. It's just Mr. Clean. No! That's my boyfriend. But it's Mr. Clean. No. Wait. That's my boyfriend. That would be Jesus. Wait. No. Oh. They just look so alike. M Mr. Clean and Jesus? So then both Hitler and Stalin decided to try to figure out which one would be more likely to be a dermatologist. They decided that since Jesus had lots of facial hair, and any self-respecting dermatologist wouldn't put anything over their glowing skin, and since Mr. Clean had lots of glowing skin all over his head, that he was the dermatologist. And so they went away with him into the bedroom. Happily ever after. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean, he's magically delicious. delicious. <laughs> oh Jesus, you're so clean now. Before you were dirty, dirty cheap. In Deutschland we polka.